Priyanka, I'm looking at this notice which has been sent to Deputy Commissioner of Kolar and I'll ask my producer to put that on the television screen which has been sent by the NCPCR. Uh, you know, this is corporal punishment, caste discrimination, everything is at play here at Morarji Desai School and it's a residential school. Maria, this is cruelty against children. This is an act of cruelty against the children. This is not only corporal punishment. This is not only uh, uh, any kind of... Uh, uh, act. Because when you are talking about corporal punishment, that is to be dealt under Section 17 of IT Act, where only disciplinary action is recommended. But where we talk about cruelty against children, a proper penal punishment is provisioned under Juvenile Justice Act. Hmm. So we must say this, that, that this is an act of cruelty against the children. And we will deal, <coughs> we will deal this like it only. Okay, so when you say this is an act of cruelty against children, uh, you are not taking uh, the, the caste of the students in consideration here? Definitely, why not? They have been discriminated, they have been treated cruel, cruelly, Due to their caste, it is evident here. The 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 entire hostel is is meant for the children from the scheduled caste community, and the teachers and the principals are forcing them for scavenging. This is a this is kind of bonded labor they are treating with them. What is the definition of child labor? As per the definition provided by Delhi High Court. Under Safe Childhood Foundation, the reported case of Safe Childhood Foundation, the court categorically said that if you offer any kind of service to a child hmm. against 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 the against the service you are taking from the children, is it is an act of child labor. So this should be considered as child labor, this should be considered as an act of cruelty and it is more heinous than we are talking it and sitting in the studios. It is more, yes, more heinous than it. Absolutely. I, I, I think um, it's alarming and, and uh, we cannot condemn it enough. Uh, my last question to you before I let you go Priyank. Uh, where does the buck stop here? Because as you heard from uh, the state's minister, he said that four officers have been sacked. So the state government is, is taking action and, and they will ensure that it's actually, not repeated. Actually, a state government is, is trying to put entire thing under the carpet. So we have already issued, to, issued a notice to deputy commissioner. After receiving the report from the district uh, district commissioner, we will definitely review the status of all such kind of hostels and schools in the state of Karnataka. So you are saying that uh, 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 all the schools will be uh, put under review now? Definitely.